This house is nestled in the lively suburb of the Serangoon Gardens and sits on a 430 square metres plot of land. It is a charming single-storey semi-detached home that was built back in the 1950s. What makes it even more special is that this is where the owner grew up. So after years of living overseas with her husband, they decided it was time to settle back in this neighbourhood. Before the owners came to us for the project, this house had been sitting empty for a period of time. Mostly just filled with old stuff, like old books and even a vintage car parked in the driveway. Instead of demolishing and rebuilding like their neighbours, the couple wanted to keep the unique character and charm of the original single-storey layout, which suited their lifestyle perfectly. Hi, I'm Paul, the co-founder of Pi Architects. The design inspiration came from the adventures across Singapore, Denmark, and recently Hong Kong. We did a lot of work to bring the home back to life, fixing up the existing structures and replacing both indoor and outdoor materials. We also made sure to allow plenty of natural light in to brighten up the space. The entryway has this charming archway that we decided to retain, which reflects the classic design of homes from this era. It honours the neighbourhood's history and makes it feel more welcoming. But we did notice that the interior spaces were a bit dim, so to brighten up the entrance, we swapped out the concrete roof slab beyond the archway for glass panels, allowing daylight in and making the space feel more open. In the living room, there weren't many windows before, so we decided to go with full-height sliding window panels. Not only does it bring in ample natural light, but it also connects beautifully to the couple's love of nature, letting them enjoy the views of the gardens right from the living space. The couple has lived in many different cities, and over the years, they have gathered some furniture pieces that reflect their journey. So we made sure to work with pieces like their three-seater sofa and coffee table that they have with them in Hong Kong, along with their beloved Eames lounge chair. To match the mid-century architecture of the house, we went with window frames that have a wood look alike finish in aluminium. They are durable and weather-resistant, but still pay homage to the home's character. Since the couple loves open spaces, we designed the layout to flow seamlessly from the living area to the dining and kitchen. This creates a warm, inviting atmosphere that fits their lifestyle and makes it easy for everyone to hang out together. As you walk in from the entry, the dining area naturally stands out. The owner put a lot of thought into creating a warm and inviting atmosphere. They chose a gorgeous soir wood table as a stunning centerpiece that pairs perfectly with the classic wishbone chairs by Carl Hansen. To add a touch of elegance, they picked out champagne gold disc pendant lamps from Louis Poulsen. These lamps not only add a touch of sophistication but also warmth into the space. Other than a place to eat, this is a cosy spot where their friends and family can gather to enjoy some wines and spirits collected from their travels. There are also art pieces that they collected over the years. This piece is one of their favourites, by a Singaporean artist Terence Teo. They like his works because of the contemporary use of colour and strokes in a very traditional medium of Chinese watercolour. Then beside it is a piece by a Danish artist, which they felt suited for the space. With the rich textures, classic design elements and thoughtful lighting, the ambience here invites conversation and connection, making it an ideal space for creating memorable moments. 
Hi everyone, I'm Juliana, and today we're looking at some really cool speakers from JBL that not only just sound amazing, but they also look great in any room. So delving into JBL's rich history, which actually started back in 1946, we see a legacy of sound innovation that's become a staple in professional settings worldwide. Tailored for audiophiles, the L100 Classic is not just a speaker, it's also a piece of sonic history blending luxury with exceptional sound. They do come in black and walnut, which is a dark, rich brown, and it also has a special cover that kind of looks like a waffle, bringing back those vintage vibes. And here is the SA750 amplifier. It's what makes the speakers work and brings out the best sound. It's super sleek and has super cool knobs and buttons that gives it its futuristic look. So just imagine these in your living space. They enhance your music, making it clear and strong, and they also add a stylish element to any room. So if you're intrigued by the sound and style of the JBL L100 Classic, don't just take my word for it, go and experience it for yourself. Click on the link or the QR code for more details and to bring this piece of history into your home. The couple's love for cooking and hosting shaped the kitchen design, focusing on functionality while keeping the vibe open and conversational. The layout encourages interaction, with open counters where the guests can gather and chat, whether they are sitting at the dining table or lounging on the sofa in the living area. To match their style, we went with built-in carpentry in a light wood finish. This creates a cohesive look that blends seamlessly with the overall design, allowing the kitchen to complement their cherished furniture and the carefully curated artwork on the walls. We also added a skylight at the back of the dry kitchen, which floods the area leading to the helper's room with natural light. This little touch is not only functional, but also brightens up the whole home while preserving its original charm. The end result is a harmonious space where culinary creativity can thrive, making gatherings feel effortless and reinforcing the couple's love for hospitality, while keeping the everything visually inviting. The bedroom was kept simple and functional. With minimal furniture, it feels uncluttered and serene. And the sunlight streams in through the full-height sliding windows, reflecting the soft, neutral tones of the decor, which makes the garden view outside a spotlight. There are study rooms for each of them which are thoughtfully designed to reflect their unique styles while keeping a cohesive look. Both rooms have comfy seating and plenty of storage for their books, so they each could have a personalised spot to focus and create. This project is unique as it is a piece of architecture from the 1950s a rare gem in today's context. As architects, we are captivated by its historical significance, viewing it as a young artefact deserving of preservation, especially in Singapore. The straightforward floor plan allowed us to focus on restoring the original structure while modernising finishes and services to align with the couple's lifestyle. This was a labour of love to restore the mid-century beauty of the home, while blending in modern touches to ensure it stands true time. 